So, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dimitri Mendez, and I'm doing another story time. This one happened today. This one has to be the most craziest, most horrifying experiences I've ever had. I'm just gonna skip disclaimers and just go along with the story. <clears throat> so, yesterday, when I came home from trick or treating, I was on Snapchat <clears throat> when I was on my one of my friend's snaps, and then it was like something about New Brain High Game shot up. It was like going to be another like act of violence at the school. So I told my mom, you know, she's like, okay, don't worry. I mean, it's going to be fine. It's a rumor. Rumors don't really don't come true. And because of the rumor, the following events happened today. Viewer discretion is advised. So I woke up today having pure anxiety. Considering the fact that I thought the school was going to get shot up. So I woke up. I was so... I was full of anxiety. I, on the way, all the way to the school bus, to the school, I was so freaking scared. And then when I come into the cafeteria in the morning, after I spiked in my ID, um... I just saw that there were less seats at the cafeteria than usual. So I'm like, why are there less people in the cafeteria? And then I figured, maybe it's because people are not coming to school. So. Of course, I'm a little bit more full of anxiety, so then I get into the classroom. And then I'm telling all my friends, oh my god, I'm so scared, I don't want to get shot up. I don't want to get killed in school, okay? I don't want to die right now. So, I do my work in period one, and then the bell rings and I have to go to period two. So, of course, after I'm done doing my work, I go to period two, which is my orchestra class, which is downstairs. And when as we were about to leave, we heard an announcement saying... Attention to Brain High students. The school is now placed under lockdown. And then I'm like, Holy moly, I, I don't want to do this. This is not my time. This is not my time. So, I was scared out of my freaking mind. I did not want to die. I did not want to have people with weapons in the school. So then... Everyone is rushing toward the back of the classroom, trying to hide. And then, we're just there, in silence, for three hours straight. It was totally dark. People were playing with their phones. And then, I don't, know, I don't think I was the only one there who was actually about to start crying, because I was actually so scared that I found the school was placed under lockdown. And then... I find out that someone threatened to bring a weapon to school for self-defense. And I'm like, okay, I can see. I can see why they would do that. Self-defense. So, of course, me being the gullible one, I decided to go ahead and put on my phone too. And then, after the lockdown is over, we are dismissed early. That's it. After I'm done talking to my friends in the orchestra, we are dismissed early. And I'm like, dude, I feel like something's missing. Of course something's missing, Dimitri. You haven't experienced period four, lunch, period three, English, and the rest of the periods. I only have 11 periods, including study hall, so. Ugh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. I wanted to have the entire school day. No, people with people that love to go ahead and and say crap to about guns and all that. You know what's really strange? 
I know some people who will talk a lot about guns and shooting them and all that, but yet they're too scared to go to school. That's that just doesn't make any sense. Anyway, enough of that side note. Um, and that's it. I didn't talk. I didn't talk to some of my friends, but not all of them. Nope, not all of them. I felt. Like, I was missing. I felt like I didn't want to go back home. I just wanted to stay in school. So that I'm at home. And I still have this feeling. I have this strange feeling. I don't know what it is. Like, I just I just feel weird. Because today was a strange day. It made me feel ang- pure anxiety of the entire day. And what are you doing? Sorry, that was my little sister and shot to make a video. Anyway. And that's how things went on. And then I looked at Snapchat. And people and I saw one person say that oh they were sending the FBI, the bomb squad, they were sending loads of people, they found multiple weapons, people were shooting. People were shooting on the second floor, and I'm like Oh, oh God. Oh, no. No, no, no. I didn't hear any gunshots whatsoever. I actually didn't hear any gunshots. So, I know that was a lie. So, of course, to fact check, I will on the news and, um, no gun, no weapons were ever found. Nobody got hurt. Nobody shot anything. No weapons were found. No one was arrested. I'm saying you're like, man, you gotta be telling like some stupid stories. You're trying to get yourself famous. But yeah, from that point on, I just feel weird. I'm feeling really, really weird. So anyway, I hope that you liked this video. If you go to the brand high school and you experience the same experience and you didn't tell story time, I'm probably gonna be the first one. So yeah. If you want, you guys want to check that out, go ahead. So, see y'all later. My Snap and Insta are in the description. Good day.